Shall we once again join our hearts and our minds in prayer? Let us pray. Lord, life can be hard. It can be confusing. It can be hurtful, nasty, fearful and terrible, tiring. Lord, we could give up, but we don't. Because we know that life can be good, it can be fun and beautiful, it can be joyous and full, full of love and happiness. Oh, that it could be like this for everyone. So today we pray for those who find life hard, that they may find some clear way through the difficulties they face. We pray for those for whom life is full of hurtful words and nastiness, May people learn to be less hurtful, less nasty. We pray for those who live in fear and in terrible conditions. May a way be found for all to live in peace and in comfort. We pray for those for whom life is tiring. May respite from the toil they experience be found in the support of others. May we find ways of reaching out like Philip accepting people where they are, teaching them your ways and not the ways of the world. May we walk with people through their hard and dark times, shining some of your light in their lives. Help us, Lord, as we remember your world, a world broken, a world divided. We pray for the people of India struggling with COVID, we pray for the people living on the borders between Russia and Ukraine, fearful for a rise in tensions and for a possible war. We pray for the people of Brazil, trying to cope with unusual leadership to fight a COVID infections. We pray for our own land, for our Queen in her time of mourning, for the royal family, we pray for our governments and ask that you will bless them with wisdom and courage in the, their actions. Make them strive to do what is right. Encourage them. And we pray for our neighbours and our friends and our families. Look after them. For we bring this prayer to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Our final piece of music is Shine, Jesus, Shine.